honey. You <laughs> That's why I brought it. <laughs> no. You get <laughs> Let me smell Joe Malone. My sis love a mimosa, okay? Hello, she. gentlemen this is amber coming to you with the fray view coming to you with another video and review and today i have a special guest guys i have my sister sarah with us today hey. and sarah if you want to introduce yourself okay <laughs> this is new i'm uh i'm sarah walden of uh, best beauty bar we're in our my suite doing this i just did her lashes yes y'all look at my lashes uh <laughs> And my eyebrows <laughs> snatched. Mm -hmm. So, um, yes, when Amber asked me to do this, I was like, this will be fun. But I didn't realize I was going to have to talk, but <laughs> duh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you're going to have to talk. <laughs> Thank you all so much for joining. If you haven't, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and comment down below. And so that we can get more people to this family. We call each other family around here. So we are sis, bruh, uncle, auntie, mama. We are all family. And I'm so glad to have you all a part of the channel today. So let's get started. <laughs> so today you all see the title. We're going to be talking about like top 10 uh, vacation fragrances. So this is my pick. So this is not Sarah's pick, but these are my picks. But we're going to kind of spice it up, see what she thinks of my picks, and she's going to be totally honest with you all, okay? Because she doesn't have to like it. But I'm going to have her smell some scents, tell you all kind of the vibes we're getting, what she thinks about it, and then introduce you to some vacation vibes that you all can take with you. Because I know that you're gonna be going on some yes. vacations, okay? Yes. Getting it. Okay, so let's get started. So my first one that I'm going to give to her, she told me that she likes a cologne smell. So if you watched my last video, we talked about this fragrance on here. This is Roberto Cavalli, okay? Oh. So this is the Paradiso Azuro. So this gives me cologne vibes. I wanted her to smell it. See what she thinks. What you think? Give them honesty. Oh yeah, this this. <laughs> I like Roberto. Yay, Roberto. <laughs> Robert. <laughs> okay. I need I need a picture of Roberto. Uh, <laughs> well, we're gonna put the notes on in, on up at the top somewhere. It's gonna be notes somewhere. But Roberto is a woody. Roberto is it gives you a little woody, mm -hmm. some watery. So can you see this on vacation? It is kind of tropic. It's not like too sweet, but mm -hmm. there is like a little sweet undertone to it. Mm -hmm. Maybe not sweet, but kind of floral. I feel okay. Floral. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was, I've been practicing my words. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I would Love definitely it. wear this on the beach. It's okay. light too. So it's not too overpowering. Okay. Yeah. All right. So she likes Roberto, that. Okay. Roberto. All right. So let's move on. So we have Ylang and Gold Mika Left. Now, this presentation it's in pretty. itself is beautiful. It's sexy. It's sexy. Mm -hmm. So when you spray this on, you get a kind um, of a gold um, tint. But we're going to have her smell. See what she thinks. Okay. So what it's, kind of vacation? It's giving me Golden Girls. Okay. Okay. It's giving me. <laughs> yeah. It's it's cute. Uh, <laughs> okay. It's giving me um. It's the vanilla. I okay. Smell vanilla. And mm -hmm. I'm, I'm not a vanilla person. Okay. So it just reminds me of my granny. Okay. 
All right. This is going to be an interesting one because I do have a lot of vanillas. Oh. Y'all know how, you know, your, your, your sis love yeah. a vanilla. But. It's giving Blanche. Okay. Golden Girls. <laughs> Blanche from Golden Girls. If you feel that vibe, That's then. It. And it's got a little gold iridescent. So mm-hmm. you can be a little sexy on the beat. Yep. So you give that little shine. But you're going to smell like a vanilla for everybody. Period. Okay. <laughs> so next we have Tom Ford. Okay. Soleil Blanc. Now this is the um eau de toilette version. So this is not the oh the perfume or perfume. This is the toilette version. What's so the difference? so the difference is it's the um oil concentration. Mm. So when you get into the eau de toilette, it's a little bit probably lighter and has less oil than a eau de perfume. So, but and it's cheaper. Ooh, no money. Okay, I like it. Okay, so what kind of vacation? This is giving like vineyard. Like I feel Ooh. rich. I feel like Ooh, rich vibes. Yeah, vineyard. Really rich. Like I'm going to the vineyard. I'm not stomping the grapes. I'm just sipping on the grapes. Oh, so you're not doing any I'm work. I'm not doing no work. No. No. <laughs> this, is, this is it. Okay. I like that. Okay. So Lux, not doing any work. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay. Put that on your list. Now, going to move to this. This is Mont Blanc Signature. Now, if you are anywhere on YouTube, you try to get this bad boy. You have heard about this. You're trying to get it. A sis already has a backup. But we're going to see what my sis thinks about this. Uh-oh. Yeah. My block. Uh-huh. I like it. Okay. I do. I do. I really like it. And it's kind of like a, if you keep smelling, it's like a fresh smell at the end. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like it. Fresh, it gives you some powdery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm um, mm-hmm. Yeah. So it gives you. This is like Sex in the City. Oh, like New York. Okay. They kind of trip, like a girl's trip to New York or something. Okay. I like it. Girl's trip to New York. Yeah. Yeah. Like it. And it's not, hey, okay, we've talked about this before, but don't you go into no Dillard's or Saks or anything like that and buy this fragrance. Y'all better go. <laughs> Y'all better go on Fragrance X or something to get it. In the 60, 70 range. Like, okay. you know, if you're going to shop in those stores, you're going to pay like 150, 140. Oh, so you might want to look on Fragrance X. Okay. I'm on Fragrance X for that one in the Burke And the one that's giving Vineyard. Uh huh. Tom Ford. Tom Ford. Okay. All right. So we got some, we got some winners. Okay. Now, this is Joe Malone. This is Mimosa and Cardamom. <laughs> Honey, you said <laughs> that's why I brought it. <laughs> but, no. You can yeah. <laughs> let me smell your mom. My sis love a mimosa, okay? Hello. She she's brunch. Brunch queen. Okay. Hello. Brunch queen. What you think? Honey. I'm taking it out to brunch. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this is good, uh-huh. John. Joe, we did it! <laughs> this is so good. Yes. Oh, this is definitely brunch. Uh huh. So mimosa. Yep. Oh yeah. Now I will tell you. Now Joe Malone does not always last. You. That's what, and I was about to say it mm-hmm. still it smells faint. Yep. Like the it's not I gonna know. last you all day. However, you can you know have this small bottle right and re-up on it throughout but it is a winner like it, it does give winner. you some citrus but it also yes. gives you that sparkling champagne flavor. yeah it gives you a little orange juice of champagne so so that is joe malone mimosa and cardamom so check that out guys yes okay well, i gotta get this before sunday oh mm-hmm. okay <laughs> So we're gonna move on to goddess, alien goddess. Okay. Uh huh. So alien um doesn't always 
work well with people. However, they kind of, to me, they went outside the box with this. The um, box, I mean, the bottle is different. It's yeah. Like, the bottle is like, it looks cute. like a cape. Yeah, kind of. Mm-hmm. Do you see? It's light, I think. Let's do it again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try to run it all together. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I got I got some old Starbucks coffee. Uh huh. I didn't have any coffee beans, so let me let me smell my coffee. Okay, smell your coffee. <laughs> I didn't come with the beans, guys, but it's okay. I used to work at Ulta. I used to run coffee beans all the time. I didn't have coffee. <laughs> some tea. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Let you know about my good coffee. <laughs> Too dainty for me. Okay. Like I told you, I like it a little stronger. Mm-hmm. But it smells good. It's it really gives you pretty. some coconut yeah. in there. Yeah. It's pretty. Do you do you get like some milky? Like is it creamy or is it more fresh? Or <laughs> you just can't smell it. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> it's not fresh. It's getting more creamy. Okay. Now this, I could definitely see, because it is light, mm-hmm. I could definitely see you being on the beach with this. Okay. Like, with your makeup. Mm-hmm. Put the lime in the coconut. Mm-hmm. Oh, and, and my, my sis, mama. my sis can sing, but we not going to put her business. Okay. I'm retired. We not going to put her business. But, yes. Okay. The alien, alien. Mm-hmm. The alien, alien got a- Alien got it. Goddess. goddess. Alien goddess. Mm-hmm. Good for ladies who like flops and stuff. Oh, yeah. I'm not into that. Okay. Yes, I am. We're going to go a little luxe. So, this is going to be your... Oh, I like the bottle. Mm-hmm. That's the Creed one. This is the Creed. It's going to run about in the 400s. Uh-huh. Got it for my birthday. <laughs> Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. And I can see how she said that. That your other yeah. Okay, so tell them, tell the viewers. Oh, one of my clients said that Gucci Guilty that I was wearing one day reminded her of this creed. Mm. And I can see how it smells like that. Because you know, what what the pheromones, different pheromones Mm -hmm. make different. Yeah, it makes a different sense. Yeah. <laughs> so I really like this. Song. Yeah. And it is um it gives you a little bit of citrusy, but it's like a luxe. Like it doesn't it's, it's not, not like too this overbearing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Daddy, if you're watching this Christmas, <laughs> Creed Aventus. Creed Aventus for her. For her. And this is um there is a, mm-hmm. a male version, but this is this can run you unisex too. Depending on, I think, like, bruh, like, if you are, if you can do a light. This is really good. It can, it can go both ways. (laughs) (laughs) All right. We're going to move on to KKW, Miss uh, Kim Kardashian. And this is the bottle of her. her. Yeah, this is her. This is. (laughs) See, it was a person or a fragrance. This is body two. Okay, now you might find this on like a Macari because it's hard to it's hard to get. But oh. this is not. Um, they might try to get you on Macari, so watch out for that too. Um, I found mine. Pricing? Yeah, as far as pricing, because it's not something that's out there. Mm. It's something that's been like I think discontinued. So oh, okay, so they might try to get you, um, but. Kim, no, not doing it for me. Okay, so Kim's not taking you there. Well, the more I smell it, it's I'm indifferent. Like, but that's good. Mm-hmm. You giving them real. Uh-huh. Take your time. It's 
first it gave me like art supply, like I was smelling crayons and stuff. Okay. Crayon. Okay. But this has got like a floral undertone mm-hmm. to it. It's not too bad. It's not bad. Okay. I'm just not feeling the nature boy though. So But would you wear it on vacation? Would I wear this on vacation? You would? Yeah, well, I don't I would. think I would wear it to the beach. I don't okay. it wouldn't even have to be like a vacation. I would wear it to like dinner. Okay. Yeah. It's like this is kinda like every day. Every I don't day. think it's like a special pull out. Okay. Like the mimosa that I got. <laughs> the mimosa and cardamom. <laughs> Joe Malone. <laughs> Joe Malone. All right. So another one that has been talked about. Tom Ford Soleil Nage. Now Tom Ford, one thing about Tom Ford, he is a unisex, so there's no, like, a female male. So, anyone can wear Tom Ford. But anybody can wear whatever they want. But um, this is kind of the the 2022 choice. Oh. Okay. I like it. I could see how it was unique. It's unique. It is. Right? To me, nobody's going to smell like you if you get that one. Like, nobody's going to smell like you. I think it's a standout. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I can see, like, where it, it is masculine, but then, like you said, it's kind of like a unisex. Mm-hmm. And it's kind of got, like, a little powdery feel to it. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I like it. Go Tom. Uh-huh. All right. So I think, I think that one is, like, a label girl, like, yeah. like she's put together. Nobody can tell her anything. She got her lashes <laughs> and her bras, and yeah, okay. <laughs> all day, all, all day, day, all day, day, all day. All right, Ooh. now go. okay, Mincera holidays. I'm gonna tell you all, like this one. I don't know if you can see it. I hunted for this one. I'm not going to lie. This was like, it was almost like, Amber, why are you about to be that deep? <laughs> and this better be off the off the chain. Is this your I first searched. time smelling it? No. Oh. I've worn this, but <laughs> this I hunted for. Now I think it's available some other places, but before it, it wasn't showing anywhere. Okay. See? It's the vanilla. It's the vanilla. Okay, yeah, it's it's very. It doesn't sh- smell um, geriatric. Go- okay, not not, not golden girl. Yeah, that's not go- golden girl. I didn't hunt for golden girl. Okay, well that's good. But it it's just it smells good, but it's just and it's not even a lot of vanilla. Mm-hmm. It's just a hint, and I just like I'm just not feeling it. And it does. But it doesn't stink. It smells good. Okay, I like it, but I wouldn't wear it. Okay, and it might sometimes it might be a little heady. So it might give you a little woozy. You know, we talked about that in my last video. But to me, if you pair it with a good um, vanilla or even if there's like a coconut body butter, it just tames it down for me, in my opinion. But Miss Sarah Holiday is not her. (laughs) And I hunted for it. (laughs) I mean, I'm sure it smells good on you. Yeah. I don't think vanilla does good on you. Yeah, and again, like, that's the great thing about fragrance, guys. Like, everybody has different um, fragrance preferences and loves and what works for them. Like, not everything is going to work for everyone. And that's what's also good about this channel because you get the real and you can try it. And, you know, if you like my sister, you like, "Mm -mm, I'm not a vanilla. (laughs) You might go to the Joe Malone, Mimosa, and Cardamom. That might be yours. Or Or Roberto Cavalli might be, you know. So you might test some other things. So whatever works for you. We just need you all to smell divine for the uh, The summertime. For the summertime. Smell divine for the summertime. Mm -hmm. Now this is, what we say, Voltaire, Voltaire, Zadi, Voltaire. Mm-hmm. So this one, this is the last one. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, you're not so much fun. This is the last one. What do you think about that one? <laughs> oh, 
see the little pictures? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I like it. It's light. Yeah. It's really light. Mm-hmm. I like him or her or, or <laughs> them. I think it's him. Anyway, I like it. Do you think it's unisex or do you think it leans more towards like women, like a feminine? Um, if my man would have told me, I don't know. Mm-hmm. And see, man, like, I, yeah, I yeah. Think this would be unisex. unisex. Definitely. And the good thing about this, guys, this is not going to run your coins. I think I got this for maybe $40, $50, if that. So this That's is a good good price. Good, good price. And it lasts, I would say, about six hours. So it's going to give you some, some time. time. Mm-hmm. Ooh, like okay. It. So give us your top three choices. So I loved Tom Ford. Tom Ford. Soleil Blanc. Soleil Blanc. Mm -hmm. Love, love, loved this one. Okay. Yep. The number one. Roberto. Okay. Roberto Cavalli. Okay. Paradiso. Azuri. Mm hmm. <laughs> these are my last. <laughs> I loved both of these. Okay. So Tom Ford, Soleil Nage, and Creed Aventus for her. So yeah. you are a Tom Ford I girl. Guess so. By default, oh yeah, Joe Malone, Mimosa, Cut a uh huh, Cut yeah. And if now you know the bigger bottle of this is more expensive, I would just put my coins because this in itself is like seventy eighty dollars, honey. But um, I would put my coins in the smaller bottle, but that's me, just because it doesn't last as long. long. But but yeah, this. Oh. This is definitely brunch. The other ones I would wear vacation. And I would wear a Roberto any day. Okay. Any, but, any day. Any okay. Day. Well, that's all, guys. Thank you so much, You're sis. So oh, this is my favorite. I'm so sad that it's over. I know. What, you'll be bad. bad. No, you'll be bad. <laughs> you will be, she will that be bad. Fun. And then I'll let you guys know some stuff that I found. Okay, yes, that would be good. Next video. So stay tuned. Make sure that you subscribe. Make sure that notification, it is red. Make sure it's gray, okay, so that you can get a post when we upload again. And when uh, Sarah is back and she's going to tell us her picks. Oh, I can't wait for that one. <laughs> and then make sure you comment, guys. Tell us what you're wearing for vacation. We definitely want to know. And give us a thumbs up so that other people can see the channel. But guys... Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for your support. I love you guys. Until next time, okay? Mm -hmm. Bye, Bye, guys. Bye.